What's up, bearded broskies? My name is Doug, the Bearded Outdoorsman. Welcome to another video. If you enjoy beard product reviews, gear reviews, EDC videos, then you have come to the right place. Today is our final thoughts video for the Bearded Banshee and Year of the Beard 2021 December. So we're gonna talk all things uh, from Bearded Banshee that we were sent. So stay tuned through the intro. <music> Welcome back. So today is final thoughts. We're going to talk all things Bearded Banshee. If you missed the unboxing, I will put a card up top and you can go check that unboxing out. And there's also update videos for every one of these products that we're going to talk about. So I'm not going to go super detail with them. Um, I'm just going to give you my thoughts on it. That's what it's called, final thoughts. I'm going to try to keep this under uh, eight to nine minutes. We'll try. Um, so yeah, let's just jump into this. First, we're going to talk about the website so the bearded banshee has a website i'll have a link to it in the description below no affiliate anything like that but you can get over check out the bearded banshee's website it is very well laid out very well organized and when you click on beard oil you get to see all the scent names and the scent profiles and you pick from there so each scent doesn't have its own uh, site in the website you go to beard oil and you pick which one you want. I love that. I like the way it's laid out so you can see all the different scents. Um, prices, everything, $15. Beard wax, beard balm, beard butter, beard oil, 15 bucks across the board. Um, I think there's some combo deals over there. I didn't look at the prices on that because I didn't have any combos. Everything I had was individual scent. So we had six products. We had um, three oils, um, a balm, a butter, and a wax. So we're going to talk about those. Like I said, I'm not going to get super detailed with the products because I did an uh, uh, update video for each of these. So you can go check out those. Um, they'll be in the same playlist so you can get over and check it out. I'm going to rank these at the end of the video. However, I'm not going to rank it on um, scent. I'm not going to rank it on scent. I'm going to rank it on product because there's one of these products that really stood out to me and was really awesome so let's just jump in i'm just going to reach over here and just randomly grab stuff like i said three oils wax balm and butter so what do we have first we have the beard balm what we had it in was the cabin and oh it smells so good so this one balm is is really that medium ground it is a conditioning balm but it does have a little bit of hold to it so it's a really good product the cabin i think he commented on the update video saying it was in the definitely in the top five of his scent profiles and i can see why it is an amazing scent so really good product i love the balm it was one of those just good all-around products you could wear it during the day you could wear it at night it just did a lot for your beard. Um, like I said, it's kind of in the middle of conditioning and had a little bit of hold to it. Not a crazy amount, but it did have a little bit of hold to it. So let's see what we can grab next. Next we have oil in backwoods. So this is one of those that I said in the update video is not an everyday scent. This is not something you're gonna wear to a business meeting or maybe not even to the office. This smells like dirt. <laughs> it smells like dirt now if you hunt if you spend any time in the outdoors then you know that that's a natural scent it's a good scent um this is one of those that if you hunt this would be perfect for your beard as a cover scent i'm just telling you um, but it's really not an everyday scent i loved it it did an amazing job the oil the ingredients of the oil did a great job for my beard really feel healthy uh, made my beard feel really good and healthy um so yeah let's see what we got next next we have beard butter and this one was in freedom and oh that smells so good so the butter is a great product at night um it did an amazing job of conditioning my beard when i went to bed i would put this in at night put this in um right after the shower um put a little bit of oil in and put this in and it was perfect if I didn't get a shower, I've got a spray bottle. I'd sp spray a little bit of water on my beard, not a whole lot, and then I'd come in with the butter and rub that throughout my beard, and it did an amazing job. Next, let's see, we have Texas Thunderstorm. Yes, it smells like rain, along with some other things. Oh, 
it smells really good. All right, so this one has the red, white, and blue label, and it's really good. The oils, I'm telling you, all three oils did an amazing job. We had the veteran, Texas Thunderstorm, and Backwoods. They all did the same. They all have the same ingredients. Um, coconut oil, sweet almond oil, jojoba oil, and essential oil for fragrance. And so they all did an amazing job in my beard, really making my beard soft, feel good, feel healthy, and no itch, none of that. No, I mean, I was really impressed by these oils. All right, so then lastly, what we have is Beard Wax in White Lightning. So let's get this popped open. Oh, smells so good. That's one thing I can say, is every one of these six different scents smelt really good. I enjoyed every single one of them. They all had their purpose, um, and they worked amazing. Now, your Beard Wax is gonna be your firm holding, uh, like your balm. So it's, it's a wax. It is gonna have a, a good hold to it, but nothing crazy. Um, I wore this, put it on the outside of my beard after I put in oil, and it really helped tame flyaways. Um, I think it would be a really good product to use during the summer when the humidity's crazy and you really have a problem with flyaways. I think that would be a really good product to use to keep your beard nice and tame. So that is it. That was, um, that was our six products. And I can tell you, like I already said, they were all amazing. Scents were just crazy good. Um, some were pretty unique. And he's got some other pretty unique scents over on the website. So you need to get over and check those out. Um, but now, my favorite product. Between oil, wax, balm, and butter. My favorite product was the beard butter. I'm telling you, this is the smoothest just white beeswax shea butter coconut oil sweet almond oil jojoba oil and essential oil for fragrance it is just a truly remarkable product now the scent is great the scent's amazing um i could put this in at night and i could still smell it in the morning so the scent duration was top notch but what it did for my beard overnight was crazy uh it did an amazing job and i say amazing a lot on this channel because it is an amazing product. You can see I am down to the bottom of this jar. I have literally used this every single night and sometimes during the day. But this, if you don't get anything else from the Bearded Banshee, you definitely need to check out his Beard Butter because it is top notch. That is the Bearded Banshee. That is Year of the Beard 2021 December Bearded Banshee and final thoughts. I'm telling you, get over, check it out. You will not be disappointed from these products. Um, I highly recommend the butter and I highly recommend the oil. Um, I'm not, if you're using this, you don't really need, in my opinion, the wax and the balm if your beard is my length. Um, if your beard's a little bit shorter, you might wanna use those other products, but I can tell you that for me, that butter was two thumbs up from me and the price is right, 15 bucks. So get over, check it out. Link in the description below for the Bearded Banshee. Don't forget, if you've missed the videos throughout this month, to get down there and check out. Get down below and find the link to the playlist um, and get over and watch the full playlist. All 2021 Year of the Beard. Um, unboxings, updates, and final thoughts for all 12 companies. So be watching because guess what? Tomorrow... Is a new year and a new month, and we're jumping off, kicking off with Year of the Beard 2022. If you missed the unboxing for that company, um, it's in its own playlist, which is Year of the Beard 2022, and that's where all those videos will be going. So make sure to check those out. Thank you, Bearded Broski, for allowing me to test out and use these products for the month of December. Get over and check them all out. Um, show. Uh, uh, Show the Bearded Banshee some love and let him know that you heard it from the Bearded Outdoorsman. And that's all I've got. We didn't keep it under eight minutes, but I tried. Okay, I tried. And yeah, until next time, stay bearded, get outdoors, and God bless.